Hello guys, this is Sakti Arun, I'm tech student from NIT Patna, who is technically supporting the missile engineer. So in this lecture video, I'm gonna teach you guys about the software installation for the C compiler. So in my lecture one, I have given a basic introduction to C programming. Also, what are the course has uh, course content, whatever I'm going to teach in this course, uh, including that I have also given about the introduction to C programming, its basic history of C programming. Okay, and also the use of C programming. So whomever missed the uh, introduction to C part, please go back to my lecture, previous lecture, and then come back to this for the software installation. Okay. So in this lecture video, I'm going to explain you about how you can download the software, uh, which is open source uh, for uh, any beginners. You can download the open source, uh, this tool, and you can work for uh, C coding. So, so what are the hands-on problems I was explaining? Uh, I'm going to explain you, you can uh, do hands-on in the software. So the software I'm going to explain you about uh, the C compilation is the code blocks. So let me type uh, code blocks in the Google. So like code blocks, type Google code blocks. So just click it up, this first link is code blocks. So just click it up here. Okay. And then go to the downloads. So there will be three options will be that download the binary release, download the source code, retrieve source code from SVN. So just click the first option, download the binary release. Okay. So in the next page, whatever the operating system you are having. So based upon the operating system, you select your uh, choice. So in I am using the Windows 10. So I am clicking the first option. Okay. So in this, I will be uh, uh, compiling the C code. So if you want a compiler along with your uh, code block, so you have to download this option. So you have to download this file. So mock it up. So I'm going to download best in these two options. You can click any one of them, but I'm going to click the source forge. So from where I'm going to download the code blocks, just click it up here. It will be redirected to the downloading page. So your downloader will be started automatically. Okay. So from here, actually I have downloaded already. So you are once you are downloaded started. So you have to wait for the time to till it gets started. Okay. So now I have already started uh, uh, downloading. So from there I will go to the next step. So let me go back to there. From here I'm going to start installation. So right click and run as administrator. So give yes. So give next. Once the wizard is open, so give next. And you agree the license. Just go through all the license. If you are ready to accept and then click I agree, uh, give it a default next. So this is the location where you are uh, for uh, all your setup files is going to be installed. So I'm giving leaving it as a default. So if you guys have some, uh, if you're not, uh, uh, if you're comfortable with the C drive, you want to have installation in your D drive, then you can change your uh, directory path. So I am just, I'm, as of now, I'm just leaving to the uh, default path. So I'm giving, clicking install. So let us wait for uh, some few more minutes to get uh, all the files to be extracted. It takes some uh, time. So code blocks is actually, uh, I, I have simulated some of my, uh, all the C programs. It's actually a, a open source one. So whomever interested uh, uh, to download, you need not to want to pay any, um, um, there is no license version. So you can go through this open source software. Okay. So I, I'm, I'm suggesting this is, this code block is actually a, uh, a suitable for a fresh beginner who is starting their uh, um, uh, fundamental programming. So this is the first one you, you are not aware of all the uh, tools and you want to start up with a fresh of C programming. Then uh, this code blocks is actually a really wonderful tool uh, 
uh, for simulating the C codes. Okay, so uh, I'm, I, I have to wait for some few more minutes uh, to get this installation to be done. Okay, now our installation is success. So once this pop-up is come, you just click yes. So as soon as you click the yes, the code block software will be opening up deep by uh, as soon as after clicking the yes. Yes, our tool is now setup is ready. So now let me uh, let me give up some uh, sample uh, uh, how the tools look like and uh, how we can. Uh, um, set up a path for the uh, files okay okay now now let me uh, let me close this let me close this let me reopen okay so I give next and I give finish okay so I'm giving finish I go to my desktop where I can see this so I just click it up Okay, now the workspace has came. Now I, for creating the new project, you go to file, new, and then you give project. See under the project, you can find a console application. You just click a console application and you can give go. Okay, so um, I'm going to give default as it is. I'm leaving it next. So in this tutorial, I'll be teaching guys about the C programming. So just click C and give next. So the first program I am giving the title as um, okay I can say um, learn basics okay so this is the part where you actually give uh, um, for your learning so you can change the directory path suppose I I want to change the directory path I just go here I go to document and then I create a new folder uh, let me create it a new folder. Uh, give a new folder name as uh, uh, C basics okay. and then I give okay I select this folder okay and then I give next so in this you can uh, leave it everything and the compiler as it is a uh, we are selecting and it is default it's a GCC compiler which came along with our, uh, our software when we are downloading just give it a finish so in in the left side you can find uh, some of the uh, extension so just expand this and our open our new uh, for project and under this main you will find the basic program so i i mean, i will go, i will teach you guys in the future about what was these things and there were what is this green color what is as as include uh, what is this in main what are these structures i'll be teaching guys in the uh, further lecture video but as of now just uh, just you can run the program and check it up uh, how the tool is working fine or not so to build any uh, whatever the program is there just go here and you will find uh, uh, so these options where you can find as a build just click it up and you will get to know whether the your build uh, program has any error or not so if you come down where you find your build log under that you will be finding like zero error zero warning so this has built successfully so to run and to check verify whether the output is coming correctly or not you just uh, uh, click it up in this green button where you can run so hello world is actually a basic default uh, C program whatever the programming language is started you start with hello world so now just I am clicking the green button this is a run option yeah now the hello world is there so um, the, the our tool is uh, working fine so in the future I'll be teaching guys about uh, the basic structure of C programming so also um, the various applications under the C programming there are various array pointers functions structures so many more kind of topics were yet to come and I'll be giving you guys uh, more example uh, real practical examples and then we can simulate every uh, pro programs in these uh, code blocks okay so catch up you guys with further more uh, topics okay in my upcoming videos just follow out uh, my uh, playlist okay thank you guys